Hi everyone, I'm here with Thomas Fullerton, a Corn Belt League player from 2021. So back when you played, you had Marty Fullerton, or Marty Burson, excuse me, as your head coach. So how was that relationship when you were playing in the league, and how is that relationship now? Yeah, Marty, uh, head coach of the Rail Riders in 21, spent, spent a lot of summers up here, but I got really close with him throughout the summer. Um, California native, so he's retired now, but I still keep in touch with him all the time. I know going back to school, we would talk once a month he's always checking our stats making sure we're staying in line back at you know for our school teams and stuff so it's uh it's cool getting close with him throughout the summer and uh if anybody knows marty fun brand of baseball um stole a lot of bases that year so it was uh, a lot of fun playing with him and just growing that relationship with him throughout the summer yeah and do you have a favorite memory from when you played in the corn belt league favorite memory you know <sighs> We spent a lot of time up here going to the College World Series games, catching those games, you know, getting really close with a lot of my teammates, my host family. Um, but it was just fun competing out here. We ended up going to the championship the summer I was here. And um, favorite memory is probably going to Wichita after the season ended um, with the all-star team and got to play with, you know, a lot of the best players from the entire league in Wichita. And, um, just all the guys we got to meet, you know, all the, the bus rides, playing mafia on the bus and, you know, hanging out at the hotel with the boys. You know, it's you can't beat that. That's something I'll always remember. And like you said, you had a host family when you played in the Corn Belt League. How was it when you first met them and how has that relationship grown over time? Yeah, uh, I guess, you know, I, 2020 was my freshman year of college, so I didn't play summer ball. It was all canceled that year. So coming up to Omaha was my first experience playing summer baseball, not living at home and college and you know I remember meeting my host family for the first time and you know I told Jenny when I met her you know hey Jenny are you guys crazy and like, what are you talking about I was like you guys just volunteered to host some college kid you've never met in your life for the summer for three months right and um, they're the most welcoming selfless people they've turned into my second family um, you know got really close with the two boys they had they were 10 and 8 at the time and they're you know a few years older now so I come back every single year I still see them all the time and you know, we boys FaceTime me on their iPads and do all the fun stuff. I get all their stat updates and videos from them, and they've really turned into my second family. So it's it's so much fun coming up here, getting to spend time with them um, and, you know, have a place to stay. And uh, they, they've really turned into my second family, definitely. So the College World Series you've come back to for quite a few years now. What keeps you coming back to Omaha? You know, uh, I guess in 22, the Vols didn't make it. I'm a big Tennessee Vols fan, being from Nashville, Tennessee. Um, choked in Notre Dame in the Super, so we didn't make it. 23-24, um, we're here now, but, you know, the host family, just keeping in contact with them, and it's it's the College World Series is something that brings everybody together, so it's fun getting to come back, spend time with them, go to all the games, you know, catch some of the boys' games, see them play with, you know, them going off in the middle school now, so it's, it's cool seeing them, but coming back, spending time with them and, and catching baseball. There's really no better place to be in the month of June. I'd say Omaha, Nebraska is where you need to be. So. And while you were playing in the Corn Belt League, what kept you motivated and focused throughout the season? Uh, you know, I had a lot of adversity the summer I was here. I was coming off a second hip surgery, and I was due for a third one that I was really pushing off. So, um, you know, just me wanting to play and compete and be out here and um, kept me really motivated. But, you know, I wanted to just get as many at-bats in as I could and, and develop and you know, honestly, winning a lot. We started winning a lot through the middle course of the year. And um, you know, just wanting to be there for your guys. And the relationships you build with your teammates, with your host family, with all the great people here in the Midwest that you get to meet, you know, they really keep you motivated to, you know, give it everything you got. So. And what advice would you give to either future or current Corn Belt League members? Uh, future or current Corn Belt League members. Um, Omaha is the best place to be in the month of June. It's uh, home of the College World Series. You know, you can go play in the Cape or the CPL, and um, but you can come to the Corn Belt League and you can get a ton of at bats. You can get a ton of experience. There's coaches here that'll help you develop. You got access to great facilities every single day, um, and you're in Omaha, Nebraska. You get to, you know home of the College World Series. There's there's really not a better place to be in America in the month of June than Omaha. I'll keep coming back every single year. So um, Corn Belt League. I mean, that's that's the way to go. Let's do it. And we have some of the boys here from your host family. If you guys want to come into frame over here. Let's go. <laughs> what is it like having him back home during the summers for the whole baseball experience of College World Series? A little crazy because 
He's a Tennessee fan, and I'm a Husker fan, but this was like living with him. I show him. <laughs> Gotta get the Tennessee gear. Let's go. Are you excited at all with him back home? Yeah. Perfect. Has he been to any of your guys' games for baseball? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Been to a couple of my games. What does it mean to have him here with you guys? Feels good because he doesn't get to see all my games, so when he does, I feel like I need to hit, hit some dingers. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you guys so much for being here. For the Corn Belt League, I'm Sydney Colin.